what's up guys welcome to bro beats and today i'm going to be showing you how to record your midi output from the scale vst so that you can edit the midi later so the first thing you'll need is this loop midi plugin or i don't know why i call it a plugin but this program um i will leave a link in the description for it to add a driver like i have here just press the plus sign if it's already there then don't worry about it so once you get that installed go up here to options go to midi settings and everything should look like this at first. So the first thing you want to do is click on your loop MIDI port on the input section. Enable that. This green sign should be up. Now you can see the output up here. This O and output looks like a zero. So we're going to put our loop MIDI port right here. Okay, select that. And we're going to put it on port zero. And why are we doing that is because it's going to be easier to remember later. So exit this. We won't have to ever do that again now we want to record a melody or find a melody that we want so we have to chain these two together all right and this is the first step to actually recording it so let's put this input port on one do not put it on zero okay don't put anything here on port zero because it will crash your daw 100 will crash it all right so put this on input one and that's easy to remember because the m the i on input looks like the one right so it's just easy to remember now go over here to your chords plugin and put your output port on one so that these match right so now these are chained and you can play whatever you want so i'm gonna just play something you know so we can re record it later so let's play this okay and that's usually how it will look right just one single note playing a full chord so to record all you have to do to put in record mode is put this port on zero that's all you have to do but that's not the last step one thing you want to keep in mind do not record this like don't press play while this green highlighted area is on your chords vst because it will crash you have to put it on whatever vst that you you know sounds that you're using so if you want to put it on fl keys you can record that all right you see and then you want to put that one if you want it on expand just record it you can see it's recording but never make make sure this is not on the actual chords vst or scale vst okay because it will crash that's pretty much how you do that now i'm going to do it with cthulhu now just so you can see it so let's turn this one off and as you can see we don't even need to touch this vst ever again so we can just delete that now let's get this cthulhu up so say delete this real quick so say okay you want to record something real quick put it on one all right so that you can get you know the melody that you want just record some all right now to put it in record mode just go down to zero and click up here and then record and there you have your chords delete that right and you can edit and delete so that's going to be it for this tutorial hopefully this helped you out hopefully this will help you record your midis and everything so like comment subscribe if you are new and i'll see you guys in the next one peace